Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome back to another episode of Dean Sisters Arabic Lesson. We'll inshallah continue our discussion on interrogative nouns. In our last lesson, we discussed the interrogative noun man, which is who, ma, which is what, and mother, which is also what. Today we'll inshallah be discussing Limada, which is why, mata, when, and aina, where. The interrogative noun limada is used to ask about the reason for an action. When we ask a question using it, the answer may start with the particle li, which means in order to. For example, limada ta'kulu kathiran, why do you eat so much? I answer, لأكون ثنينا, to become fat, or in order to become fat. Another example, لماذا تريد أن تكون ثمينا? Why do you want to become fat? I reply, لأنني نحيف جدا, because I am very thin. Another example, لماذا أنت في المصر? Why are you in Egypt? I reply, لأدرس اللغة العربية To study the Arabic language. The interrogative noun, mata, is used to ask about the time of an action, that is, when. This is why the answer should include time. For example, mata تستيقظ When do you wake up? I reply, أستيقظ الساعة الخامسة. I wake up 5 o'clock. متى ستعود? When will you return? I reply, سأعود بعد أسبوع إن شاء الله. I will return after a week, God willing. The last interrogative noun we'll be discussing today is أين? And it is used to ask about the place where the action takes place. That is where. For example, Aina to Sadli, why do you pray? Usadli fil masjid, I pray in the mosque. Aina mi'tafuka, where is your coat? Mi'tafi fi sayyara, my coat is in the car. Wa aina sayyara, and where is the car? A sayyara, amam al bayt. The car is in front of the house. This brings us to the end of today's lesson. Fiamani la, see you next time.